Good morning everyone, welcome back to grade 5 mathematics class. I hope all of you have finished all the activities that we mentioned in the previous class. Today we will talk about expanded form and standard form of a number. Now look at this number given here, how do you read this number? This is 3 crores 72 lakh 41,175. You can see all the places marked at the top and the place values are given below. Let's see the place values. This 3 has the place value 3 crore, 70 lakhs, 2 lakhs, 40,000, 1,000, 100, 7 has the place value of 7 tenths or 70 and 5 is in 1's place. So, the place value here is 5. So, these are the place values of the digits that form this number. So, can we say this number is the sum of all these place values? So, we can write this number equals 3 crore plus 70 lakhs plus 2 lakh plus 40,000 plus 1000 plus 100 plus 70 plus 5 which is the place value of each digit in this number. So, this part is called the expanded form of this given number. So, when a number is when a number is written as the sum of the place values of its digits, it is called the expanded form of the given number. Let us see how we can write the standard form of a number given the expanded form. Okay? So, when the expanded form is given, you have to write down all the numbers vertically in appropriate columns add them together and you will get a resulting number. This is the short form of the expanded form and when you insert commas in between the digits to separate the periods you get the standard form. See this example, these are the place values from the previous expanded form, I have arranged it vertically in appropriate columns. Now the answer you get is this here. Now, I have also inserted commas in between. So, this resulting number is the standard form of this expanded form. So, as an activity for the day, all of you please take exercise 1.2 in page number 5 of your textbook. The first question is write the expanded form of the following numbers. Then the second one is write the following numbers in standard form. The first question in both these cases we will do here, rest of the questions you have to do yourself. So, let us see the first question from question 1a, it is 97 lakh 28,321. Let us see how we can write the expanded form for this number. So, this equals the place value of 9 here is 90 lakhs. 7 has the place value of 7 lakhs plus 2 has the place value 20,000 plus 8,000 plus place value of 3 is 300 plus 20 plus 1. So, this is the expanded form for this number. Now, from the second set of questions, let us see the first one. You have to write the given expanded form in standard form. First one is 5 lakh plus 1000 plus 700 plus 8. How do you get the standard form when you are given the expanded form? You have to arrange the given numbers vertically in appropriate columns. So, this plus
Now let us say the first question from the second set of questions. Question A is 5 lakh plus 1000 plus 700 plus 8. How do you get the standard form from the expanded form? Arrange all the numbers vertically in appropriate columns and add them together. So, this is the question. I have arranged all the numbers vertically here so that the 1s come in the same column, 10s come in the same column and so on. So, when you add them together, what you are getting here is the resulting standard form. So, for the answer, so the answer for this one is 5,1708. I hope this is clear to you. You have to write down the answers for the rest of the questions in your notebook and also at the back side of your textbook, you can see a picture like this. You are given a hyperlink there where you can access the digital content that comes with this textbook. There is also a token number for this textbook. Please also check that out. Now for today, we saw the expanded form and standard form of a number. I hope it was clear to you. That is all for today. We will meet in the next class. Until then, bye.